Hi YouTube, so it's been quite a while since I've done a video. Um, I don't even remember what the last update was. So, um, I think what I'll do is I'll talk about my concert that I went to. And, uh, I don't know, just do updates and random stuff. I'll talk about the concert. So, I can actually. Okay. I keep my ticket all together, um, just in this little book. Nothing special. Broken, just yeah. But, it's good. It has, you know. Anyway, so, here's a bag my ticket. I can add another ticket to it. Another ticket, which is just a gold ice cream. So, yeah. So, I don't know if you all know, but, um, the concert I went to was actually bad. Ooh, there it is. Was actually. Taylor Swift! Well, I was still for a few seconds there. <laughs> but, yeah. That's what it was. Um, so yeah, um, the Taylor Swift Red Tour, it was awesome. It was a pain in the butt, though, to get to well, to get to stadium because, um, well, oh, and that's the back, obviously. I paid like a hundred, I paid a hundred dollars for it. So that's fine. Because my friend's mother couldn't go because she was pregnant and she just had her baby Maya. Maya was actually a month old yesterday. Pretty cute. <laughs> so light. Didn't want to hurt the baby when I was holding it. I was like, ah! <laughs> Put in the car seat. But anyway, off topic. Um, she gave me, no, she told me that I could have the ticket. So I was very lucky to go. It was at the investors group field, the new, um, stadium. Which was really awesome because I was at the first stadium in when, sorry, first stadium. I was at the first concert in the new sta uh, stadium. So I was like, my dad goes next month for Paul McCartney um, at the Investors Group Field. But anyway, it was funny because I saw um, the guy that I asked where to go was actually the guy that I met and all of that at one of the colleges I went to, like to. I love tickets. So we went to to just talk to him about college, right? And he showed us around. So, yeah. Um, that is not a ticket. That is a receipt. Anyway. Um, so, back to the thing. Um, so we went to look around, we saw the stadium, well, yeah, we looked around to try to find our seat, because we are 40, okay, we are row 43, so we are on the floor, and we were in section, section E, so row 43 in, in section E, so that was right in the middle, what am I doing, I don't know, so, it was just right in the middle of the thing. So, it was fun. We found our seats, we sat down, and we were like, oh, we are, we are like overjoyed. We are so happy, happy to be at a Taylor Swift concert, right? Cause, oh, I always forget how to pronounce his name. But Austin Moore was there, and the guy that sings Lego House. 
um, Ed Sheen, and oh, I always forget his name, but I was like so close to him. Um, like I could walk up to him, like in three steps, and then he's like right there. So I was like, ah. Um, what else? Um, but we stood in line to get bag, well, a shirt, and it turns out, like, I didn't have cash on me, because I just paid a hundred dollars to get the ticket, to get in here. So, I had, like, fifteen dollars on me, and that's not enough for anything at the concert. So, for five bucks, I bought a thing of popcorn, and yes, it was five bucks. Um, so, I only had ten, I don't know, ten, ten, I think. Or I had more than 15 minutes. But, like, I don't know, it was just a pain in the butt because it turns out their ATMs weren't working. And I was like, I waited in this line for an hour. Well, there's people singing, like, opening up. Um, I only missed Austin. But, like, and you, it I don't know, it just made me mad, like the, oh, not ATMs, the Visa, sorry, debit machines weren't working. So I was like, okay, just give me the debit machine and let me try. She was like, okay, um, if it works, let me know, because it hadn't been working for a couple of hours. And I'm like, well, if it hasn't been working, then you should have announced it over the intercom, so people, you know, don't waste their time waiting in line. Just to get a bag, or a keychain, you know, something cheap. So I ended up getting for ten bucks this bag. It's like a gym bag or something. I really want to hang up in my room, but my room's like that it has its own theme kind of thing. It's blue and brown, deeper print, whatever. So there's really no way of me putting red. I mean, there's red back there, but it all fits in somehow. <laughs> but, yeah, this is what the bag looks like. It's just a drawstring. So, Taylor, uh, sorry, red, Taylor Swift. And it has the bit string, so. Yeah. So, when I was sitting, yikes, I guess I was, yeah, that's fine. Um, so I don't know where I want to put that, like, I might want to put on my door there. Sure. Sorry, that angle for that light reason in the But, um, I guess my friend, Shiona, felt bad, and she, um, you know, you know. She gave me this bracelet at nowhere. It was five bucks. Um, her mother gave her sixty dollars of the money I gave her for the ticket. So this is the bracelet she got me or gave to me. Taylor Swift. Yes. Yeah. It's kind of weird, um, if you want to know a few facts, that, oh, a few fun facts, Taylor Swift's middle name is Allison. Taylor Allison Swift. I think it's that anyway, I have to look it up, because now I'm double thinking it. I'm pretty sure it's that, Allison. And then, um, she named her cat off of one of the, um, characters in Grey's Anatomy. Um, Murdus or whatever. Yes, I'm a geek. Um, and her birthday is December 13th, which is pretty cool. Now I sound stalkerish. <laughs> anyway, so if you thought. Um, what else? So yeah, that's just the bracelet. Works. So we got dropped off. They had trouble with the parking situation for the game last time there. I don't want to make this video too long, but I kind of have to, I guess. But, so her mom drove us, dropped us off, and she had two kids in the middle. 
like a newborn and a one-year-old. So it's like, ooh, you're brave taking all of us, the two of us, to the stadium with all the driving and not all the driving, but all the cars and traffic and all that. So, so like it was easy to get in and drop to drop us off and get there. We weren't late, but I wouldn't suggest taking a bus. Well, some people have their own ways if you leave early enough. Because for the game, um, football game, they people were an hour late, I think it was. So, yeah, I got this. It's just a sunshine girl behind it. Awkward. <laughs> but it says, um, no swift exit. More traffic. I can't even read it that way. Uh, who's turning? Well, that's not really important. But, you know, it's just talking about, like, right there, if you want, somehow. You can pause the video and read it. Um, so that's the traffic, how bad it was leaving the concert. Um, and then this is what she looked like for her o the opening. She looked very nice. Ooh, all the outfits she wore, I would wear. She did not look like herself there, doesn't she? Didn't look like herself there. <laughs> she looked all serious. Uh, it says getting into Taylor Swift's concert at the stadium was easy. Um, but getting out, not so much. Anyway, my mom got this for me. Um, sorry I'm talking fast, I just want to get everything finished out, so let's make another video since I've been making updates. Um, so she sang a whole bunch of songs, like from her red album, obviously, but like, she sang, um, you belong with me, apparently somebody from the meet and greet. Um, I wish I met her. But I did do something else. Um that was awkward. <laughs> but and um somebody from the meet and greet asked her if she could sing that from her old album. And she was like, Yeah, sure. Um sorry, I keep saying um but during the concert, she was all over the stadium. All over. She was in front of us, behind us, up there, over there, down there. <laughs> she even got changed fast on the stage. She was like, there, you witnessed your fast change. And I'm like, whoa, you just got changed? <laughs> um, yeah. What else was there? She talked about, when she sang the song Mean, she talked about how it's not easy growing up and how when you're young, you just want to grow up because you think life would be easier. No bullies, no, no anything, right? Just life would be easier. But then she says that once you grow up, it's, everything's still there. Nothing gets easier in life, but you get stronger, right? Um, bullies are still there. You still get bullied when you're an adult. So, I mean, everything, bullies are always going to be there. Life's always going to be tough. She's saying that you just have to be strong and you'll get through it. So, what else did she do? Um, we saw all these security guards go down the middle of the aisle and we, my friend Shiona and I were like, whoa. What's going on? Is there somebody fighting up there? Or what, right? We're just, what's happening? Um, turns out they're laying wire along the aisles so she can walk through the aisles. I'm like, oh, I'm super happy. So I got to touch her hand. <laughs> <This is him. laughs> but I was so happy. I was like, I got to touch your hand, like Taylor Swift's hand. Um, sorry, I'm happy. <laughs> but everybody else was lo looking at her, um, 
we're standing on the chairs. There are so many times where the guy told us, get down from the chair. I think he gave up because we didn't listen to him. <laughs> but we stood up on the chairs and watched her sing on the stage behind us. Apparently, one just rose out of nowhere. Boom. That's where she sang, um, You Belong With Me. She looked at me. Yeah. Anyway, you get it. <laughs> and then I realized that everybody is standing with her. And that the stage is lower, lowering down, but everybody's still watching her, right? And there's a spot right there that I could fit through. I'm like, I'm going to get down, and I'm going to go to that aisle where I can. So as soon as she came, I was like, Taylor! She touched my hand, and eye contact, booyah, and we, she smiled. And, yeah, pretty awesome. I'm very blessed that I got to go because it was a sold out concert. Because I said I to my dad, I would really like to go to the Taylor Swift concert. And if you can't get that, a flat screen TV. Turns out, well, I got my flat screen TV. And I got my concert. Best of both worlds. <laughs> but anyway, I'm sorry I'm blabbering. Um, I just want to tell you my experience and how it fun it was. Um, like, I'm very happy I got to go. Um, it was a good night out. I'm sad it's done, but, you know, I'll cherish this memory forever. And, I guess since I'm talking about concerts right now, I'll just show you how many concerts I do. Tickets I do have for different things. Yeah, I'll try to not go over. Well, I'm gonna try to make it 20 minutes exact. Sorry. So, um, Da Vinci. That was at the MTS um, Center, not the MTS Center, but the exhibit hall. Right. Woo. Anyway, I went with family for my. 15th birthday. Um, that's actually, no, that's not. Then this is the last time the moose was ever here. I have Gavin's ticket. I have three tickets. So I think I have my dad's Gavin and Gavin's. Anyway. So this is the division final. Um, Friday, May 6th. 2011. That was the last time the Manitou the Moose was here. Um, that's the same ticket, Manitou the Moose. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. This is a different Manitoba Moose game. I think. Not sure. Anyway. Then this is just. I can't really take it, but. Dream House? I saw. Gross, but. I went there. For, on my birthday. See, the 30th. On the 9th month. So that was for my. 16th birthday, I think it was. And then Dream House. I guess I had my mom's. And then this one is the Bodies Exhibit at the MTS Center Exhibit Hall, which, that picture, whew, that picture there, that's the body with the basketball. My mom was pregnant five weeks? Five weeks. Five months, maybe? I'm not sure. Um, this is the Tragically Hip I went to with my dad. It was last minute concert, actually. We didn't know we were going to go until the night. And my dad bought the tickets. So, it was a good seat. We were not on the um, floor, but we were on the side, just by the stage. This is Roger Waters, the wall, live. Might be over 20 minutes, sorry. But yeah. Um, we, for this one, we were. This is the MTS Center. So, the MTS Center, we were this 
the wall was okay. the wall was here and we are here like we are sitting here so the door where Roger Waters came out was right here and so we were like five feet away from him which is awesome um I'd rather be five seats away from an actual famous person than being way over there <laughs> anyway then Roger Waters <laughs> live we went so we went to see this Roger Waters concert first and then we went to see this Roger Waters concert second the day it, we went to this one and my dad went to this concert the same concert again at the same place so two days in a row he went to see that concert and then the third day we saw this one in Minneapolis yes we're crazy for going to the same show over I know it's wasting money but it's good to say that You've seen Pink Floyd this many times. I mean, I know it's not Pink Floyd. It's one member of the band. Anyway. Then, the U2 360 tour. This was at the Canad Stadium. So, this was my first stadium concert. And then, um, the Taylor Swift was my second um, stadium concert. Then Roger Waters live again at the XL Center. I've seen him three times, by the way. The Red River Co-op Speedway. Yeah. Just race cars. My sister was like five months, not five months, nine months. After the Minneapolis, um, the Minneapolis concert for uh, Roger Waters, we went to see Minnie. Minnesota Wild versus Washington Capitals. So this was my first NHL game, which is pretty awesome. Because um, this is probably the only NHL game I'll see for a while. Because like, see, it was twenty eight dollars for this NHL game, for the Capitals too. But if you have the Winnipeg Jet, the tickets are like more than a hundred bucks. Okay. And it's hard, it's not even the money issue. It's just trying to get your hands on, like, the ticket. Um, well, this is Taylor, the Taylor Swift concert, you guys. My nails are all gross, I'm sorry. Like, they're starting to come down. My real nails are growing. Um, this is the Winnipeg Gold Eyes I showed you. And Valley Fair, the photo for the body exhibit. This is just Roger Waters and she's in her receipt. Anyway, it's not bad, 23 minutes. Okay, it is bad, but I had thought that I should talk to you about this because I've been meaning to tell you guys about this. And no way in. No. I'm not meaning. Bleh. I am not bragging whatsoever. I just thought, you know, what the hell, I'll talk about Taylor Swift, and, um, you know, the other tickets, so it's like, whatever, do it all in one video. The next video I think I'm going to do is what's on my iPod, and I'll make it what's on my iPod, because, well, I have to. Anyway. Mwah. Thank you for watching, and if you have any questions, comment below, and don't forget to subscribe, and yeah, just like the video. <laughs> anyway, bye.